Hello, this is Eli at SafeNet. After the installation of LDK, uh, you might find two programs uh, of SafeNet Sentinel. You have Sentinel EMS and Sentinel LDK. If you press on Sentinel EMS, you get Launch Sentinel EMS. And as you can see, there is a browser opening to allow you entering into DMS, which is as a matter of fact a web application. You use the defaults of admin and admin in order to log in to EMS. Further details about DMS I will provide on another session. Right now, let me get back to the programs of SafeNet. As we said, we have the EMS, but we also have the LDK. In the LDK, we have the vendor suite. And the vendor suite, once I launch it, I have an option to enter into either the envelope, which is used to uh, protect the file, protect the executable or DLL, or a toolbox, which is a component to be using for practicing and seeing how the different uh, various APIs that we have uh, are working. And also additional tools like uh, documentation and uh, uh, Rust utility and other things that you need and the documentation. If I go to uh, C program files or as a matter of fact uh, uh, over here SafeNet, no sorry it's not here, program file SafeNet Sentinel I see two subdirectories, one of the Sentinel EMS, and here you see all the files that relates to the Sentinel EMS. And in the Sentinel LDK, you might see all the files that uh, resides, uh, including the envelope, API documents, uh, and samples, and other things that you might be using. Also, we can uh, run the Admin Control Center from here. As we said, the Admin Control Center is the utility uh, which is part of the uh, runtime or the driver uh, and allows you to see what are the keys connected and such uh, functionalities. Thank you for watching.